Hello and welcome along to another DARA online services help video. In this video we are going to take a look at the DARA Firm Investment Planner. This planner will assist you in planning for new construction or structural changes to your firm by allowing you to label existing buildings, mark those to be demolished and map the location and size of planned buildings. In order to access the planner we must be logged into our DARA online services account and choose the Firm Investment Planner option. At this point you have the opportunity to read the guidance notes or select the Farm Investment Planner for the map to load. When the map appears you have two options in order to find your farm business on the map. You can zoom in using your mouse wheel or select the I want to blue button and search by postcode option. Enter your postcode and select OK. The map will then zoom to your postcode location. You can zoom in further using your mouse wheel to see the fine detail if required or pan to the area you want to label. In order to label buildings on your farm investment planner map, select the I want to blue button and the draw and label buildings option. You can choose to label an existing building, label a building which is or is to be demolished, or mark up a proposed building. In the first example we will select the label an existing building option and click next. This brings up a list of building types. Click to select the appropriate type of building, in our case a dairy cow house, and click next. Then click on the location you want to add the label to. You can choose at this point to finish your drawing or add another drawing. We will add another drawing to show you the second example. The se second example we will label a building which is or is to be demolished. Select that option and click next. Choose the appropriate building type, in our case a calf house, and click next. Proceed to click the location you want to add the label to. We will add another drawing to show you the final example, which is mark up a proposed building. Select that option and click Next. Select the building type, in this case a glass house or polytunnel, and click Next. We are now required to sketch the outside perimeter of the building using our mouse. Double click to start the drawing. Click once to change direction. And double click to finish the drawing. You will notice the proposed building, in this case the glass house or polytunnel, will have a green label and return the size of the building. Existing buildings, in our case the dairy cow house, will have a blue label. Whereas a building to be demolished or is to be demolished will have a red label. Once you have finished your drawing, it is important that you save your map as both a PDF or JPEG and save the shape file. Having your shape file will enable you to send it to DARA for future schemes or services. DARA can use your shape file to overlay other important business information, such as how close buildings are to environmentally sensitive areas, waterways, flooded areas, or to assess or advise on applications to future schemes. You will not be able to use the shapefile yourself, but having your map saved as a PDF or JPEG will allow you to view your farm investment plan map. In order to save your map as a PDF or JPEG, click on the I want to blue button and select the print map option, followed by the save PDF or JPEG button. At this point you will need to enter your farm business ID. You can add additional notes if required and select the type of output you want, PDF or JPEG, before clicking Next. Please note you may need to allow pop-ups for your web browser to allow your map to load in a new window. If pop-ups are disabled, the Farm Investment Planner may restart. If your map opens as a new window, you can save it by clicking File and Save As. 
and saved your map to your computer for future reference. If you intend to submit a farm investment planner map as part of an application to the Farm Business Improvement Scheme capital category, you should also save your shape file for later submission to DARA. To do this, return to the application window and go to the I want to blue button. Select print map and this time choose the save shape file button. Confirm the download by clicking OK and save your shapefile to your computer. Your shapefile will save to a folder called Export and will contain a number of files which you can send to DARA for future schemes or services. If you wish to delete a drawing you can do so by selecting the I want to blue button and the undo clear labels option. You can then choose to clear previous drawing or clear all drawings. In our case we will select clear all drawings before clicking next to confirm the deletion. This will delete all drawings from your map. This concludes the Farm Investment Planner help video. If you have any further queries on DARA online services or the Farm Investment Planner, please contact us using the details on screen. Thank you.